what's up you guys after show reacts here and today i'm going to be reacting to some more angel <sighs> this is season five episode 20 uh getting really really close to the finale this is the last episode i will be reacting to today um i plan to react to the last two episodes together um just yeah um so this is gonna be very sad if this ends in a cliffhanger that leads on to next week I mean, like, not next week. I mean, like, the next episode. You know what I mean? Okay. Anyways, whatever. Right. Okay. Getting kind of nervous whenever I'm pressing play on these now. Because it's, like, nearly the end. Yeah. Let's get into it. We need to act on this now. Not without a full risk analysis. We don't want to be rushing into this thing half cocked. As opposed to the full. I love that he's not wearing suits helpful. anymore. We'll send Spike. Bugger that. Do it yourself. <clears throat> Spike, this is a delicate matter that needs to be handled with a lot of finesse. And why the hell are we talking to him? Because he signed on to help. Not to be some glorified garbage collector. We need to go there, retrieve his body, and return it to his family in the next. Ooh, 26 hours. Or what? He gets deader? No, he stays dead. They die. They pupate, they live again, but only if the proper rituals are performed by the immediate family. Yeah, I understand. Thanks. All right, what is it this time? Uber vamps, demon gods, devil robots? That's Buffy. Shut up for a second. What do you mean? What about her? I'll be all right. She will be when I get there. What happened? What happened? The immortal. The who? The foulest evil. Hell will ever vomit it full. Worse than you? It was spotted in Rome <laughs> near Buffy's. Wait a minute. Rome, that's where the capo died. Harmony, have the jet fuel ready for takeoff. Do you really think we can take him? Oh, what do you mean, we? What, you don't think I'm gonna let you traipse off to Italy without me, do you? Just do I put her up there? Right in, save the day, I don't know. Buffy off of her. Like you're not thinking the same thing. I'm already seeing somebody. What happened to a guy can't just go up in flames and then show up the next day? What happened to that spike? But sure, I... Oh. Oh. <laughs> the inner angel shipper. But I feel like that's over. I feel like they really like finished that. But I still have a soft spot for them. But it's Buffy. Oh my god. <laughs> Do I grab the pop doll? Because I don't. <sighs> I'm really comfortable. I'm like, I would have to get up and grab it and find it amongst the pops that are like in front of it. I'll look. When we see her, I'll probably get too excited that I'll need to put it up there. But for now, it's okay. How did you know she was in trouble? I got word. From who? Source. You have been spying on her? I just wanted to make sure she was all right. Sending your lackeys to do your stalking for you. That is really pathetic. All right, fine. I'm not proud of it, but it's... It's Buffy. That doesn't make it okay. <laughs> it's Buffy. She's fine. The immortal thinks he can do this to us. He doesn't know who he's dealing with. Yeah, well, he's about to find out. Ah. He's going to curse the day he ever crossed purpose with Angelus. And William the Bloody... Yeah. His benevolence, the immortal, wishes to convey his regrets at having uh, detained you. But your recent actions against his concerns merited stiff reprimand. His concerns? This is our city. We were here first. No, actually, he was. 300 years ago. I'll snatch your little wee sticks out of the air and spend the next fortnight shoving them slowly up your arse. <laughs> Can you really do that? The arrow thing? I don't know, never tried. The accent is so oh, bad. Are you talking about plants, plants again? The green. Oh, okay. Maybe you I can hear his song of the green. green. You have to be careful not to agitate her. 
Burkles. See, I told you they would remember us. Guess we do make an impression. Uh, uh. Andrew! Spike? Oh, my God. <laughs> Why are they? Why is he all of a sudden so friendly with them when they're waking a wolf from a heart and they wouldn't help Fred? Don't appreciate that. Where'd she go? To meet the immortal. By herself? I told you I had plans. When did she leave? Just missed her. It's Buffy. Not too late. Of course, it could be worse. Why do you feel like you need to protect her? Nights, they never leave the house. Just curl up on the couch and snuggle. They're snuggling. Ah, oh, Buffy and like immortal people. I swear. I'd claw my way back from the depths of hell to lay by your side. It's an awfully romantic of you. He's tasted you. Who? Who do you think? I'm sorry, but this is a bit weird. <laughs> I feel like it's a little not in character. A little bit. Angelus has always been someone that takes what he wants, okay? Why is he getting jealous of this one dude? I understand Spike, okay? Spike 100% is in character. But why does it seem like he's like best mates with Spike right now? And like he's like super jealous? Like, he's never given a fuck. Like, he... He basically um, let Holt have Dala. And some other chick, I think. I can't remember exactly. Like, to save his own skin. Why? This... I don't know. <laughs> the man has no sense of indecency. You remember Frankfurt? He hatches the wrath rune egg personally, and then just decides to give those nuns safe passage. Those were my nuns! Yeah, nuns are your thing. Everybody knows that. They respect it, they respect us. <laughs> We're the reason men fear the night. Right now, Angel and Angelus seem like the exact same person. That's what's bothering me. It's the fact that, like, this whole time you're supposed to think that you know, they're two separate beings so that you can, I guess, root for one and hate the other or whatever, you know, you know what I mean? And like right now, they're acting exactly like the same person and so it's hard to decipher them apart. I don't. I don't like the- I, Spike's fine. Spike is exactly Spike. But Angelus is not acting like Angelus. There's something you need to know. Fred. Mom? Well, there she is now. Dad, oh my god, what are y'all doing here? Sweetie? Thought you were so right. Oh, you look great. Oh. We're just gonna gloss over that? Oh yeah, here it comes. Barbara, you run off alone. Big hero, so Buffy will take you back. Well, news flash, Blondie Bear, never gonna happen. Look, I know I don't have a shot, but they're all right. Yeah, you do! But I still care about her, and I'm not gonna let it end up with a jerk like the Immortals. The head. I thought you had it. Ah! Where do you think you're going with our head, Jeeves? Okay, it's fine. So nice Fight, thing. and right Buffy will join, and <laughs> never mind. Telling me Buffy doesn't know this is going on. Loved him many million dreams ago. Wise men often fool. Now he'd like to say I'm Here sorry. <laughs> Can you see within his heart? Guys. <laughs> Where'd the little guy go? There's like a whole bunch of people! And what? She didn't notice? Hello? Ash, come on, punch it! Stop holding on so tight. <gasps> I'm like you're ever gonna catch up to a car or that thing. Well, cut him off. All right, all right. Ah, <laughs> oh, jeez. Go! 
One job, you know, hang on to the head. That's it. You were right there too. I wasn't in charge of the head. Well, it's gone now, isn't it? Weren't you the one that was carrying it? That's right. No more screwing around. We find that guy, we get the head back, and then we get the hell out of here. That's it. Have you seen the blonde girl? Buffy. The name is Buffy. She was just dancing with the immortal. Are they still here? Doesn't Wolfman Hart have an office here in Rome? Why didn't they just send people in Rome to get this body then? Spike! <laughs> you are the very meaning of handsome. You take my breath away. <gasps> I have no breath. <laughs> and you That's want very biblicious. I gotta tell you, everyone is so dang friendly. I can't get over it. Well, they kind of have to be, Daddy. I'm their boss. If they're mean to you, I'll just fire them. <laughs> We've not seen each other since I ran over that bug demon with the bus. How is that even possible? Is this whole laboratory yours, honey? Well, technically it's the company's, but yeah, I'm in charge of it. <laughs> Want to see my office? That's it up there? Come on, baby. Ooh. I don't understand. Your grief hangs off of you like rotted flesh. I couldn't tolerate it from them How as well. How did you? It's a simple modulation of my form. I appear as I choose. So messed up. How are you good? Like, not Fred! <laughs> I thought your problem. Our friend. It, My problem is that you need to cover up, lady. <laughs> I'm sorry. Mount Everest. <laughs> we need to keep your head. <laughs> yes. We know all about your mission to retrieve the Capo di Familia. Then and why I'm didn't you do it? Right. Now. right. No, we're going to need a chase helicopter, an assault team, and guns. Lots and lots of guns. No, 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 no. The two of you are so precious, but. This is a civilized country. We do these things all the time. Somebody gets kidnapped, somebody pays the money, everybody goes home happy. It's just sad y'all can't stay longer. Well, the beach is calling. Wesley, you take care of our little Fred for us, okay? Of course. Mm -hmm. Did you get what you needed from that experience? Yes. It was most informative. Good. Don't ever do it again. What makes him the immortal? You know the immortal. Is he a vampire? <laughs> I knew it. None of this is a coincidence. It's been his plan all along. Steal our head, keep us busy, then traipse off with my girl. Our girl. It's a setup. You're just as lackey. I should be so lucky. I'm getting a little tired of Italy. Know what you mean? Oh, look. The Americans are relying on violence to solve the problems. What a surprise. Oh! in the middle? The immortal neck deep in all of this. Of course he is. He's screwing us. He screwed us before and he's screwing us now. Every time we hear his bleeding name, we end up standing in the strata holding the bag. You guys truly are dumb together. <laughs> my jacket ripped it off the body of a dead slayer. What which gives it great sentimental value? Yeah. Besides, I've been wearing it for over thirty years. It's like a part of me. It's just one more thing he's taken away that I'll never get back. Yeah, this is good. I'm glad you like because I sent another ten of them to Los Angeles for you, along with a fine assortment. But the sentimental value. <gasps> Yo, That's the ugliest the fucking jacket that? I've ever Thank seen. You know, we're champions. Got this under control. Now we're just gonna work. Should we just go home? Oh god, yes. Is Buffy back yet? Sorry, not yet. Buffy fell for the immortal on her own, and, and now she's happy. That's it. But she's not finished baking yet. I gotta wait till she's done baking, you know, until she finds herself, because that's the drill. Fine. I'm waiting patiently, and meanwhile, the immortal's eating cookie dough. She's moving on. You guys do the same. You might catch her one day. One of you, anyway. But you keep running in place, you're gonna find she's long gone. Us. Chasing around like a couple of henpecked teenagers. I don't know why you are, to be honest. Ciao. Okay. Come on, Andrew. <laughs> well, sure. Maybe it's time. <laughs> yeah. You like this? It sickens me. Oh, Lord. 
We both know that ain't true. Stop it. Change back. Be blue. Be anything. Don't be her. Gun. We lost the head. Start preparing the troops for war. Head's in your office. What? With regards, the immortal. I not really hate that guy. What's Buffy thinking? Honestly. She doesn't exactly have the best taste in men. Case in point. Hey. She did Briley. That's the bad one. I wasn't a project. Well, neither was I. Can't we just lock her away in a box? Well, no one no. can touch her, you know? Like we did with Pavane. No. I don't think she'd let us, man. She's, she's pretty strong. As we speak, I'm moving on. Moving on. Oh, yeah. Right now. Move it. Well, I'm really offended that we didn't actually see Buffy. <sighs> this was a funny episode. But it was a lot of dumb. It was a whole lot of dumb. And like, we got Drusilla and we got Dala as well in flashbacks. But it was like so... Basic, like, there wasn't really anything. We never even seen this immortal dude! I don't know. It's good to see Andrew again. And you know, the, um, the Spangel banter was funny. It was hilarious. But there was no, I don't really understand the idea of the episode. <laughs> like, Spike was like, I can't go up in flames and then just show up one day. It'll take it all away. But then all of a sudden, nah, screw that. Angel's going to see her, I'm going to go see her too. But then... I, okay, sure. Whatever. Um, <laughs> whatever. Well, there's only two more episodes left of Angel. Um... I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one.